Hey y'all, this is Julian Rico. Um, if y'all already heard this from the Carolina Panthers, we just got a new head coach. It's not Mike Vrabel. It's not Bill Belichick, which we didn't get an interview with Bill Belichick. Not him. It's not um, Bill Jim Harbaugh. He got hired by the Chargers yesterday. So check that video out from yesterday. Good video. Um, the big news is... Your new head coach is David Canales. So, who is Dave Canales? Well, I'm going to read this. And this is his his, his coaching career. So, for um, Dave Canales, he started his coaching career in Carson High School as an offensive coordinator in California from 2004 to 2005. Um, then he goes to El Camino College as the special teams and tight ends coach. Really interesting. Really interesting guy. This is the big one. This is the reason why Carolina hired him. Um, so he joined Pete Carroll and USC as an assistant strength coach back in 2009. Uh, before then, he went to Seattle to join Pete Carroll to become the wide receiver coach where he's won a Super Bowl uh, with the Seahawks wide receivers with Doug Baldwin. Um, who are the other ones? Doug Baldwin, uh, Tyler Lockett. Um, I'm trying to think of other receivers who he's been through. Uh, Jermaine Curtis, who got the game-winning touchdown against the Packers in the NFC Championship game. Still remember that guy. Um, that's him. He also knew Dave, Dan Morgan, who is now the general manager for Carolina. He was part of the Seahawks organization, too. Those two got to know each other. So that's another quick thought there. Um, then he turned as the quarterback's coach to be with Geno Smith. If you look what he did to Geno Smith, okay, and I'm going to read this article right here, so, so y'all might want to listen carefully. Um, in 2010, blah, blah, blah. That was um, him. Sorry, my fault. In 2022 season, he, Geno Smith had a high effect lead as the team's starting quarterback and was named Comeback Player of the Year while also earning his first Pro Bowl appearance. So you better give Canales credit. So he developed Geno Smith from, he's been gone for, eight, he hasn't played football in eight years, and he won Comeback Player of the Year because of who? Dave Canales. Don't say Shea Warland, because he did call the offense, but, but Dave Canales developed Geno Smith. That's your quote. That's a surprise. And then last year, and then he just, and then he became the offensive coordinator for the Buccaneers. And it's a well deserved job for him. I think it's a well deserved for him to be the offensive coordinator. They bring Baker Mayfield, and this is really a team that surprised all of us as he also developed Baker Mayfield. Um, so I think, so my. My my reaction is, I think this is a good hire, okay? Look, you go back to what he did in Seattle and, of course, with Tampa. I mean, he's the guy to take over this Panthers team. Dan Morgan is trying to build not a guy. He's bringing in a guy who, who's saying, oh, we're not going to bring, bring in Ben Johnson. No. We're going to bring on Bobby Sloak. No. We're bringing a guy who can fix Bryce Young. And I think Dave Canales is the answer. Now, he will fix Bryce Young. The other question for me is, what is the team going to look like? Is Ajit Sajuro, the Panthers DC, going to be back as Panthers defense corner? Or will he take a job like the Seahawks, who are really interesting in him? So... We'll see that, but congrats to Dave Canales. Uh, Panthers fans, um, hit the like button, subscribe, leave a comment below. Is this the best hire for the Panthers, or is there, or is there a name out there that should have been the Panthers head coach?